Hey everybody, in today's video we're going to talk about being in a coma. No, that's not sensitive. Hey David, what is lens coma? Coma is a type of lens aberration. And what that means is that it's a, a fault of the lens in the way that it transmits light. Now, look, no lens is perfect. Every lens that you get is gonna have some kind of flaw somewhere, whether it's light drop off on the edges, uh, softness on the edges, distortion of some sort, whether it's barrel or pin cushion. Um, coma is one of those types of issues that a lens can have. And since a perfect lens is, lens is inherently unachievable, there are always going to be trade-offs as to which types of aberrations or faults are acceptable or unacceptable in performance. Coma is one of the ones that's generally considered unacceptable, although when a lens has tons of coma, the images like a Petzval lens can be fairly interesting in some uses. Coma appears in an image typically on the edges, and what it is is it's when you get close to the edge of a frame, a dot of light ceases to be a dot and turns into a cone of light or some other type of shape. And in enough of a quantity, it can make sort of a spirally circular looking um, blur to the background, like the pets foals that I just cited. And it reduces in general, it's usually the worst wide open. And then it reduces in, with time over, uh, with stopping down it's in severity. Uh, one of the lenses I had that had a lot of coma was a Vivitar 24 millimeter F2. Tons and tons of coma, especially wide open. And, and some of the samples you're seeing came from that lens. So that's what coma is. Coma is just uh, a loss of a point source of light's ability to be a point and turning it into a cone or some other similarly related shape as you get closer and closer to the edge of a frame causing an an odd behavior to the out of focus area. But the coma itself is the flaw that causes the point to have an elongated shape. 